What are going on guys and welcome to Christmas Crew. Today I'm going to show you how to back up games on Multiman on your PlayStation 3. I've never done this tutorial and there are plenty of tutorials about that out on the internet but I think why the fuck just not make a tutorial because of the sake of uploading a video instead of uploading nothing. So what you need is obviously PlayStation 3 and Multiman installed and I think everybody has Multiman installed. Now basically to back up games what you need to do is have the actual game disc you can let if you don't if you don't want to buy a game basically what you can do is ask your friends disc from the game for two hours maximum okay so you ask the disc what you do is put in your playstation you open up multi-man like i just do let that load quickly and as you can see multi-man just loaded and popped up and i'm quickly gonna mute the tv sound because it's so annoying like the singing i don't know what it's arabic i think no clue but it's just a really annoying sound uh, basically, this is the game that I got in my PS3 currently, Modern Warfare 2. And basically, how you back up your game is really easy. You press triangle, you go to copy, and you're gonna select PS3 uh, and then slash dev underscore HDD0. If you have a USB stick, you can also select your USB stick. So whenever you plug in your USB stick, it will load from a USB stick in your PlayStation 3. I'm gonna select my PlayStation 3 hard drive for the sake of the tutorial. I'm gonna click on OK. And as do you want to copy the game BD ROM to internal hard drive? You're gonna click on yes, verify data, and as you can see, it starts copying over. Now it shows you a crazy long time, 34 minutes. This is just estimated, and it will never take this long. Like early, it'll go really, really fast at some point. So basically, I'm just letting it go. I'm not. Ugh, I can't talk. I'm letting this run in the background. I'm gonna cut the soil off here. Once it's finished copying over, I'll catch you back. And as you can see, we are only a few seconds remaining before it's ended. But as you can see, it ended just now copying over. Uh, it didn't take that long. Oh shit. I just spilled my Red Bull all over the place. Holy crap. Every time when I clean my room, I just make it a mess. Anyway, so uh, whilst my Red Bull is on my desk, just gonna quickly finish the video. So as you can see, it says it tells you to press square, square to continue. So what you're gonna do is take control, press square. And boom it shows you the disc here and if everything should be right as you can see it shows you here Modern Warfare 2 on your hard drive now basically what you could do is just click on the disc or just press X on it it's verifying some data and it should start in a second well you, sh you should be able to launch it yourself I mean but uh, just for a matter of fact let me do for the tutorial let me quickly go and sign in uh, and once we sign in, as you can see, it shows Modern Warfare 2. This is actually the disc. Okay, I'm gonna take it out. So we currently have no disc inside, but if we go to app underscore home underscore PS3 underscore game, you can just still launch the game. And as you can see, Modern Warfare 2 showed up. And then now we're playing without a game. And there you go, we are in game right now. Um, so yeah, play online. People asking to play me games, but meh, I need to record videos and everything. But as you can see, guys, we're currently on World of War 2, the game I just copied over without CD in my PlayStation. As you can see, let me show you it again. There is no CD in. Um, we're only playing through here. But yeah, guys, this was the tutorial. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment, like, and subscribe. And if you want me to do a tutorial about PlayStation 3, uh, about a question or anything uh, be sure to leave it down in the comment section below and I'll try to make the video as quick as possible for you guys with that being said it's your boy Chris the Screw and I'm out adios